parental liability in teenage car accidents. Good morning, I'm attorney Neil Burns and I'm gonna talk a little bit today about parents who are responsible for their teenagers in car accidents. Some parents think that they are clever enough to buy a car for their kid, insure it separately, and say, hey, we're not responsible if there's an accident. And uh, they may not be, but there are ways around this, and I'm gonna give an example of, uh, of a case that we had uh, here some years ago. Our client was a victim. There were two groups of teenagers in two cars. Our client was in the back seat of the girl's car, and they were racing with the boy's car. The boys saw that there was a curve in the road. They slowed down. The girl's car slammed into a telephone pole, literally wrapped around the pole, and our client was in a body cast. She was in a body cast for the senior prom uh, in high school. It was a really bad situation, really bad injuries. And the insurance company said, hey, we'll pay the policy because we know this is uh, clearly our, our insured's fault, but that's all we're gonna pay, and that's all they were obligated to pay. We filed suit and we brought in the parents to show that they knew or should have known that this young lady should not have been driving, they shouldn't have bought her a car. And in this instance, of course, all the teenagers knew each other and we were able to and snarl the driver in a lie, and actually multiple lies. Uh, she lied about which car she had driven. She lied in front of her mother. She lied in front of her father. Uh, she lied in front of our client. And the, the students, the teenagers all knew each other, so they knew what was going to happen, and they knew that we could now prove that she was a liar and that the parents, when, when it got time for their deposition, they couldn't possibly tell the truth because they didn't. there was two different ways for the story to go. As a result of that, not only did we get the full policy from the insurance company, but we got private money from the parents because they were, again, too clever in this instance to uh, get away with this. If your family member was injured by a teenage driver, don't let up with just getting the policy. Don't let up with just saying, well, they're just teenagers. There's insurance there. We have a lot of experience. I've been practicing law for 35 years. My partner, Rashawn Jan, and I would love to help you love to resolve your case. Lots of people get seriously injured because of teenagers' negligence, distracted driving, whatever the cause of their negligence is, we will help you. Please give us a call. Thank you.